Hej hej, mitt namn är Karina. What is fika? Fika is a Swedish word that means like having a coffee break, basically. You can drink coffee, tea, whatever, it doesn't matter. But it's a time of the day for a break and a social thing. It's like a norm. You have a fika almost every day in Sweden, especially at work. So why not fika in Korea? School. Do. So, my man Dominic, he is from Korea. Och vi ska spela in när vi lär oss varandras språk och kultur, helt enkelt. Dominic har varit i Sverige två gånger, han älskar det och han kan några svenska ord. Och han har precis börjat faktiskt lära sig lite svenska genom en bok. Um, här, här kan ni se vilken bok det är. Och jag tänkte eftersom jag lär mig koreanska och han lär sig svenska så kanske vi kan dela med oss av våra erfarenheter med er. Um, så om du är intresserad av att titta på hur vi pluggar och gärna ge oss tips så vore det jättebra. Förlåt om min svenska är uh, trög, <laughs> för jag har inte pratat det på jättelänge, ärligt talat. Alltså jag pratar ju det med min familj då och då, men annars liksom bara skriver mest, you know. Mycket text, texting, texting, skrivande, ja. Yeah. My husband doesn't want to be on camera due to his work. Um, he just doesn't want his identity be, to be out there. However, he does really want to do videos with me, so I think uh, in the beginning uh, he'll be wearing a, uh, like, what do you call it? Like a mask? Like a party mask? Just to, you know, so people can't see exactly who he is. I hope you guys understand. Okay, this is my husband, Dominic. Do -do -do -do. 안녕하세요. 저는 도민입니다. 저는 제 나이는 땡땡 살이고요. 저는 도, 서울에 살았었고요. 지금은 동탄에 살고 있고요. 일은 하고 있고요. 감사합니다. 감사합니다. We're going to play a game called Guess the Word in Swedish or Korean. We've written uh, Swedish and Korean words in this box here. So, what's the first word? Bad. Bad. Bad is bad, I think. Sleeping bad. Something bad? Yeah. Why? No, no, no. Sleeping bad. bad. A bed? Bed. Like bed? Mm. Nope. What's this then? Bad means to bathe, swim. Go swimming. I don't like swimming, so swimming is bad. I can't remember that. <laughs> no, swimming is fun. What are you talking about? <laughs> Swimming bad. Good. I can't remember that. Oh, swimming fun. Oh, number four is my lucky number, so let's go with this. Michida. Mm. <clears throat> Am I pronouncing it? Michida. 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 But not the. Michida. Not the. No, not the bad no? word. Not no? the bad word. Yeah, there's It's crazy. Word. It means crazy. Yeah, yeah. It has that, but my point was different point. There is another one. Tell me. I don't know this. One. That means. Reach something reached that like uh, you studied hard to reach the good score. Uh, like reaching. Yeah, reach something. So it's like that. So that's a famous sentence that 미쳐야 미친다. To reach something, you have to be crazy about it. Can you give me like a very common sentence. So like, where where can I use 미치다 as in reach? Ah. Like I reached my goal. Can I say it like that? Yep, yep. 목표를 미쳤어요. Ah, but but it's, it's not from from you to there. So okay. Like uh, I did that, or something. 영향을 미쳤어요, like that. 영화를 영향 effect 영향. effect 영향을 미쳤어. Reached. reached. Okay. You you will learn many sentences and then you will figure out the difference. I kind of know. 미치다 is Either crazy mm. or rich, mm. basically. Your turn! My turn. Oh my god. Scratta. Scratta. Sculpture. Sculpture? Sculpture, yeah. Scratta. 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 Here's a hint. Laughing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, laughing. Oh. Does it sound like laughing? Scratta? I think so. Okay. Scratta. 
Scratta. <laughs> Scratta. It sounds more like a skiing something. Ski? Yeah, Scratta. Laughing. Mi dotta. Mi dotta. Correct? Okay, mi dotta. Mi dotta, mi dotta. Dotta sounds like tapta, which is tapta, like frustration. Or mi doyo. Oh. It could be trust. Is it trust? How could you? How? Oh. Mi, oh, mi doyo, mi doyo. It's something like a trustable. I forgot like this word, I know it actually. Yeah. <laughs> right, it's it's trust to trust someone. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the, the dictionary word is mi dotta, which is confusing because you never use that. You use mi doyo. Mi doun saram or mon mi doun saram like that. Mi doun saram, yeah, 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 yeah. Mi mi Trustable like person. That. Yeah, so. Mm -hmm. I didn't expect that Karina guessed that. Points for me, okay. I got two points. I put easy ones in here. I'm not being mean. <laughs> because a lot of these words I already Kiss. taught him. Kiss. I taught you this one. But the problem is I have such a bad memory. <laughs> kiss. Right? Kiss. Kiss, yeah. But it's not kiss, so right. That's why you should remember, it's so funny. It means to pee. Oh, right. Or like pee. Right. Yeah, not to pee. Kissa. Is to be kiss is the P. Swedish interesting person. Interesting people. Interesting people. Kiss. My turn. Number two. Purusurum Hada. Purusurum Hada. Purusurum Hada. Never heard this word before. It sounds like blues. Oh. Blues. Purusurum hada. No. Purusurum hada. Something music about music. That's the only thing I have. Something. Something positive. I think. Something you know. You got swag. Something like that. I don't know. What is it? What is it? Good guess. You know, puruda mm -hmm. is blue. Mm -hmm. Puru surumada is more like a, it's a bit bluish. Oh, Blue. bluish. I was close then. I should yeah. get half a point there. No, no, no. So <laughs> okay. You got zero point finally. Puru surumada, puru surumada. Greenish. Uri cotton nen puru sum haneyo. Right, right, right. But not interesting. Interesting thing is we. Puruda, it can be blue or green. We just define it it's as like a... It's like a little tur turquoise then. Turquoise? What's turquoise like? This is turquoise. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. That, like that. Yeah, so it's turquoise. Mm, turquoise. Turquoise. Mm. Nice. Uh, your turn. Etta. I know etta means eating, so etta is eight. Eat. Yes. Eat. Correct. You got a point. Finally. Finally. Atta. Mokta. Atta. Mm. Eat. Eat. Pa. 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 It means rice. It's a actually very good start in start of conversation when you use because like I know Westerners starts like start sentence conversation with like oh today's weather is good like that uh, you guys talk about the weather true but in korea we uh, somehow we just start the conversation with rice like oh, did you eat your meal mm -hmm. at least you have to eat something like so we are we're very like uh, focused on the rice so you can always rice is a very very good topic that you can start with one left. One left. And how many points do I have? Three, three. I, I have up. Uh, yeah, I have three and you have oh. one. Three. Now I know this word. Gotsagare. <laughs> the landowner. Gotsagare. You have Thank to explain you. why you know this word. <laughs> I have to? I have to? Yeah, it's so random. Like, why do you know this word? 
It's because of not this book. Not this book. Okay, yeah. another book. Yeah. But then he has like uh, Swedish books here. Yeah. But you saw this Korean Swedish book, mm -hmm. and you learned a bunch of random words, mm. and then he remembers Gotsägare. Yeah. Which is like, why, why, why do you know that word? Read the landowner uh, because. I, there was a bunch of like uh, books like Kala Kar like, like that, and uh, I, that were somehow attract me like, oh that's my dream. I wanna be the Gotsa guy, so I have to remember that. Yeah, True. That was that one. True story. True story. <laughs> the landowner Gotsa guy. Uh, Kachilada. Ka, more like ga. Kachilada, Kachilada, Kachilada. I don't know if I've heard this or not. I don't know why, but it's something like I don't know why it reminds me of knife mm. because cut. Good point. Good point. Gotcha. Something a little negative. Right. It is right. It means like a cranky like that. Cranky. Uh, yeah, I knew it was something. Like uh, it literally like me like a kachi kachi rada means the surface is very not smooth. It's more like very hard, mm -hmm. very tough, mm -hmm. and if you add a verb, like add hada with that word, then it becomes more like a described personality, like a person have very tough surface or like not smooth, which means he's very cranky, right? So. That makes a lot of sense. Right, so right. something is gakchil, mm -hmm. that's just like not smooth surface, mm -hmm. and gakchil hada, is like your personality is too like yeah not smooth you yeah, know it's my <laughs> so thanks for watching this was uh, 10 words in swedish and uh, korean mm -hmm. hope you enjoyed hope you learned something or just entertained right and uh, don't forget to fika fika bye bye fika fika ja hasjo jang chara You do look good in that mask. <sighs> I know. <laughs> oh, should I do like this way? Yeah, zero. Zero. <laughs> 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 <laughs>